be right there. Welcome to the special edition of Wake Life. It's the Team Rider Cup again, seventh year in a row, brought to you again by Trojan. We've got some very big names. We've got nine of the best teams hitting the water at Cables Wake Park in Penrith. Now, for many years in a row, we've had the Team Rider Cup. Uh, it's been such a fun event, and uh, it wouldn't happen without our sponsors. Now, Glenn Faust, not a lot of people know you by face. We're going to put you in front of the camera this time. You're the guy who's responsible for uh, basically backing this event for the last few years in a row. Um, back again at uh, Cables Wake, Penrith. It's been a long time running. I mean, how do you feel about these sorts of events? I think they're great. There should be more of them. And that's one thing Australia is lacking at the moment. Not enough uh, competitions for the good guys. And it brings out the customers from our shop, makes them see what they can do. Now, what products do you stock in the store? Uh, Ronix, uh, Liquid Force, Hyperlite, Double Up, CWB, um, quite a few other ba basically things. everything you've, you've got it everything all. yep yeah. and that's out at Windsor yep now on top of this the Team Rider Cup you've also got your own little rail event which has been ticking on ticking along just quite nicely actually if I don't mind was it the sixth just recently yeah the seventh it was seventh the s seven years in a row the uh, Trojan car park rail jam talk us through how that started ah uh, yeah we actually started we saw, uh, well I went over to the States to Orlando and saw them run something like that one year. Uh, so we got a bunch of hail bars together and some plastic and made pools and did our first one. And it, well, you know, it was great, a lot of work. Then they started doing these pump up pools. So I thought, yep, we can do this every year. So first team out there on the water, CWB, followed by Control. And then we got Slingshot, and then the Ronix team, LF Australia, and then Biley, and then Slingshot International, and also an LF International. All right, so once again, we're gonna be starting off right here with the CWB team. Now five minutes per team. And how it's gonna work is, each rider will be judged on each section of the course. We've got the kickers, we've got the transfer box and the taxi. Then we got the big uh, rainbow rail or Nessie. Then we've got the flat bar in the Alps and then there's also gonna be some flat water tricks right here before the final corner. Okay, we're here today with Team CWB, starting off with our senior member of the team, Mr. Tony Iacconi. How are you, Tony? I'm um, very well, thanks. How are you? Yeah, good, thank you. Now, tell us a little bit about your trip to the States. I hear you had a quite a good result overseas this year. Yeah, this year was my first year doing the six months over in the States, so I wasn't planning on doing too well in the contest. I was just going over there to see what it was like, but I ended up winning two of the events over there, which I was super pumped with, and got a second overall for the Junior King Awake. Okay, so you're currently the junior champion, is that correct? Second in the juniors, yeah. In the world? Yeah, in the world. Congratulations, mate. That's a fantastic result for CWB. And this, awesome. is, your, this is your cable board? Uh, this is the cable board. It's a Jive 137. It's a hybrid board. It's got some channels there, fins, grind base, and I love riding it. Tony Iacone on the inside. On the water, there's Nick Maxwell. Frontside five for Nick Maxwell. And what about you, Nick? Tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, I've been wakeboarding for basically about two years. I usually compete heaps behind the boat. Um, you know, I'm just trying to have a bit of fun with cable and stuff like that, so yeah. Tell us a little bit about the, the boots that you're wearing today. Um, the, the boots I ride, uh, they're called the Prism, the CWB Prism. Um, they're really good boot. They're kind of stiff where they need to be. Um, perfect, they've got like one lace, um, so it just, tightens your feet perfect. They've got like their inner booty, um, so they're perfect for like walking around the cable park and riding all day. Uh, Control are making a very firm play into the market uh, in Australia and behind me is the team. Would you like to meet them? Dougie, you work here. You're riding a very lovely board. Excellent. Um, talk to me about what this is first. Uh, so this is the new 2013 Supreme. Uh, so it's based on the same mould as last year, but uh, new tough base on the bottom 
um, pretty much stiff between the feet and bendy past the foot, so it's perfect for everything you want in cable, really. Dougie on in on the heel side. Yeah, grabbing mute. Front side 180. Coming on through, finishing off his uh, first lap with a roll to revert. For the Wake Life Team Rider Cup, doing it up for control. We'll give it up for Angie Schreiber. And then a roll to revert around the outside for Angie Schreiber. Let's move on to the pretty one in the team. Uh, Angie, how, how you doing? Nice to see you. Pretty in pink. Um, been a while since we've seen you. Uh, maybe talk us through what you've been doing this year. Um, geez, I've been on the tour for nine months, so it's been incredible. Been around the world, travelled to like maybe 13 or 14 different countries, and I just won the WWA World Champs and the Rail event, so I'm pretty stoked about that. Yeah, biggest achievement of the year. Big back mob into the corner there from Matty Hasler. And then Maddie with a nice gap up to nose press. Nick Malvani with a nice little backside 180 to start it. Once again, challenging conditions out there. Oh, getting opened out. Nick Mulvaney right there with a nose grab to backside 180. Okay, next up is Team Slingshots, and I have with me Pat Riordoran. Uh, welcome. Okay, uh, mate. Yeah, excellent to see you. The most important thing I think you need to convey to everybody is just how good is your TV? Yeah, it's, uh, it's a Chang Hong, 42-inch mm -hmm. LCD, uh, three HDMI inputs, USB, Full HD. I don't know what else have I told you about. I think it's oh, only one oh, remote, one single remote for everything. Yeah, but the real clincher is the DVD player is inside the TV, so you never really need to look for two remotes. It's just really convenient. Even down in the remote, it just sits in your palm well. Battery's down back for balance. It's ideal. Slingshot Oz. Pat Reardon in on the heel side. Yeah, big method glide off the wave kicker. Loading that line, big S band on the outside. Pat going tail press up, nose press down. Christian Robinson right here for Slingshot Oz. And Christian, uh, we haven't seen you around for a while. Uh, Perth, I think, Western Australia, Mandra maybe. Um, you've been riding a little bit, uh, but again, I'm sure everyone at home probably wants to know, more importantly, how are the cats? Oh, yeah, the cats are great. I'm not really a fan of real life cats, more so just photos of cats. Cats in space, cats in deserts, you know. It's cats, I mean. What do you think about that action? We've got more coming up after the break. Yeah, keep it right there. 